A Las Vegas funeral home is going green. It's the first in the state to use water cremation instead of fire. Fox 5's Kyla Gaylor joins us live from there now near Flamingo and Durango to tell us about it. Kyla? Water, fire, they're both classic elements of Earth. But when it comes to cremation, one is much kinder to Earth, and some say much kinder to the human body. Just being a gentler process, personally, is it just seemed to click for me. Bob Alexander is a planner. Well, I love to organize events, and one of the things that will be the final thing that I organize is my own funeral. He and his wife decided they want to be cremated through water, not fire. The fire, I think, of the Holocaust. It's called aquamation, and they do it here at Kraft Sussman Funeral Home. Uh, given that our bodies are 65% water, uh, we come into this world in water, uh, and many religions are baptized in water, uh, it makes sense in, in so many ways to be able to use water for the disposition. The machine itself looks a little bit intimidating. It, it looks very futuristic, but uh, it does the trick. How exactly? The water is elevated uh, to 300 degrees. Uh, there's an alkalinity uh, that's an introduced to the water. As I always enjoy a nice warm bath, this would be a good way to dispose of my body. Bob is part of a growing cremation trend. In Southern Nevada, 80% of people opt for cremation. So I believe in, in not damaging the earth any more than it already is damaged. Aquamation leaves one-tenth of the carbon footprint of flame-based cremation. And there's zero emissions. There's no harmful gases that are being released into the environment. Uh, everything is, is contained within this vessel. The vessel is able to create more remains, too. It just looks a little different. With the water-based cremation, they come out pure white. This is definitely the way to go for me. Just not yet. I plan on not using this for at least another 20, 30 years, but you just never know. Kraft Sussman Funeral Home is just one of 14 firms across the nation that use aquamation. They are waiting for one more part, and if needed, the machine will be ready to go by next week. Reporting live, Kyla Gaylor, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.